Foot like a bee, Danny Min here, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Straight, the finale. So we have to break out of Cat Catraz here. We're basically stuck in jail after the double cross. Blazer, who is supposed to be helping the resistance, sort of betrayed me and uh, Clementine. Oh, we don't go that way. Turn back, Cat. Uh, up you go and now we are in uh, essentially like what is robot jail <laughs> and we have to escape robot jail uh, I think we're nearing the end as well uh, up you go Ooh, that's, uh, that was a uh, that was a hell of a jump nice jump cat well done tiddles uh, yeah so oh there we are we're in jail yes Jail it is. Now I think what I need to do is like jump onto that. Maybe not jump onto that. I thought that's the one I potentially had to jump onto. Could be this one over here. Up we go. Alright, jump down there. Ah, okay, and then onto there. Onto the bottles. So I could have possibly have. Uh... Now this is not my. This is not my cell. This is a different cell. Oh, I'm, I'm hearing things. Could we free these poor people? I don't think we can. Okay, how does one get out of here? I've lost B12 as well. So we've lost Clementine and B12. Right, up we go. Looks like I am potentially going up there. There we go. We'll explore everything because I am more than a few memories down. I definitely missed some memories in the sewers. Etc. Is this? Oh, there's a sentinel right there, actually. Okay, I think I see the way past. That's not the way past. Oh, I could actually jump down there. <laughs> that was lucky. Uh, right, jump. No, 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 no. I need you to jump down there. Uh, uh, Tiddles, yep. And I need you to run in here quick before that sentinel comes back. This guy is very dead. I'm gonna run in here because I want to check everything. Oh man, this guy died hugging the toilet bowl. That's unfortunate. Right, where is the. Right, it's there. We could have hidden in the box. I don't think we really need to hide in the box. Some interesting music in this area. Yeah, I was just wondering how far that sentinel actually came across. Looks like there's no way to go this way. Right, it's gone. Up the stairs we go. Right, so we now are behind this one. Wait, I need to jump up there, right? Maybe I don't need to jump up there? It kind of feels like I need to jump up there. I'm not seeing any sort of jump prompts. Okay, run over this way. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. That was close. Right, we'll wait for the sentinel. Ah, okay, I see where I have to go now. I'm not actually in range of the sentinel here, so we can just go ahead and jump up. Man, this cat is doing a lot of jumping. It's Clem! Hello, Clem. I will break you out of this hell on Earth if I can. Okay, so there are the keys. Uh, I still don't have B12 though, so I can't hack any of the doors. There is, in fact, a window there. 
Uh, we're not going up. Oh, here we go. Uh, right. Is there anything in here? So it's just a random room. Okay, so I can go out this way. Round the back. Grab the key. Up you go. There's the yard. This prison is in poor condition. Uh, I would imagine it wouldn't be difficult to break out here. There you go. There you go, Clem. Okay, let's get the hell out of Dodge. Now, I'd be very surprised if there are actual memories here. And the your cell was not the greatest. No mattress in the bed. I suppose that doesn't mind if you are a robot. Right, which way do you want to go? I'm following you now. And you've got the keys. Yeah, you could probably break out here pretty easily. The, the place is pretty decrepit. Okay, do you want me to lead the way? I will lead the way. It's just a wide open spaces, and wide open spaces scare me. Uh, there's not a great amount of cover here. Okay, don't don't stand on me, obviously. All right, so we're going around this way. Oh wait, Tiddles has found something. Oh, it's B12. No. What have they done to you? Right, we can't leave B12 there. Obviously, she's going to come across and say something, but because we don't have B12, we're not going to be able to understand her. Yeah. Yeah, no idea what you just said, but I have to rescue my friend. She's on board, it looks like. So there could have been a possibly an easier way to freedom out that way, but we are we've chosen to rescue B12. Right, come on, Clem. Post haste. I can't sprint down these stairs. Yeah, there are a few sentinels and things sort of floating about. So we might die here. Yeah, I'll go, I'll go around that way. And then alley oop. No guard in here either, so is this literally all sentinels here? I don't think. Can I actually jump past there or do I jump on I jump up here? Okay, that gets me up. Can I jump on the light? I can. But that sentinel was in this room, right? Maybe it's not in the room? Okay, so it was there. Jump in. Uh, there's a laser grid field thing there. Yeah, be surprised if there were memories in here, unless B12 himself did a stint in the prison. Right, I understand the laser grid now. Oh god. Yeah, I kind of need to run. There we go. Oh god! Uh, I need to jump up. And then I need to jump over. Then jump down. Jump into the box. Plan out our next set of moves. Out of the box. 
go around here. Okay, so that's how I shut off. Okay, they have been alerted. That's maybe bad. Is that other sentinel still there? Jump in the box. So they're they're on alert. Right. Does this one turn round? Yes, he does. Uh oh. Jump up. Come on. And then I think I can literally jump back through here. Uh oh. There's no. Where did I get in here? It's there. <laughs> right, we almost died. There we go. We've got B12 back. Nice. Yeah, we're happy. Oh, and I got my vest back. I felt like I was trapped in my lab's computer system, all alone. But you came back for me. I can't believe it. You're a good friend. Leave no man behind the RB12. I'm so glad that we are all together again. But we're not safe yet, yes. We need to find a way out of here. Can you open that door just there? Yeah, sure. Yeah, we're still deep inside the prison, so... We are by no means safe yet. Uh, two seconds there, Clem. I need to look around for memories. Okay, do you need me to do something here? You've got the keys. Ha! There you go, have more bricks. <laughs> uh, where are you going with that brick? Okay. Right, that was phenomenally loud. So I know, and then I get a, I get a boost up on the head. Very nice. Who? Who? There we go. That was a that was an excellent bit of teamwork there. I'm sure there was a quieter way than just smashing that glass. Right, have you still got the keys? Please tell me you still got the keys. Those sentinels are blocking the way again. They will spot me instantly. Maybe you can try to bait them into those cells and lock them in. Yes. Because I am the cat and I have to do everything. Right, what cells? There's a random man over here. Let's speak to random man. Hello. Pablo, do you see that guy on the ground over there? He was rebooted. I don't want to lose my memory. I'm so scared. I remember one of the other AI characters saying that his friend Pablo was, was in here. Yeah, this guy over here is pretty screwed up. Okay, so I can't actually move these. Are you dead? Altera Suter. This recovery center has done me the greatest good. My mind is clear and lucid. I'm an exemplary citizen now. Hey, you want to see the battery? That's some quite advanced technology there. Right, you're not in good shape there. How do I get this? Here we go. Right, he's coming over. He's going that way. Lock the door. Quickly. 
Okay, so that's the first one is dealt with. Come on, Clementine. How do you like to be locked up there, sucker? Right. How are we getting through this area? There's a memory. I see an actual memory. Excuse me, Clem. Got a memory to deal with. Remember. This poor fellow. It seems that the Sentinels are ruthless when it comes to defying them. Uh, that's what I feared. They have completely erased him. No more emotions, no more self-awareness, no more memories. Please let's not get caught. So there was a memory in the prison. Right, hold on there. Uh, Clem? Alright, where's the cell for the... Oh. Hold the fort. Whoa, 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 whoa. Ah oh, man, I was totally going serpentine there. Right, so I need to bait these two in. And this one comes all the way over here. Right, does this sell? Right, I wonder if they'll both come over. Right, you're in. And then I need you to come in. Oh. Close the door. Close the door. Close the door. <laughs> right, that was close. I think we got them both, though. That was uh, pretty intense, actually. I think I could have trapped one in at that side, and before it realized, I could have trapped the other one in there. But we made it through. It's the waiting room. Nice. So we are getting closer. Uh, do you have a key for this door also? Do we need to unlock it somehow? Right, Clem. What's going on? Talk to me. Uh, stay alert. We aren't in the clear yet. Okay. I think I can get through here, though. You can't. But I can. Right, hold on. Very nice. Very nice. Uh, this door. It's the only way out of this jail. I think we can open it from the control room over there. We have to find a way to get access to that room, though. Let, let's look around. Yes, let's. A little weird car thing over there. Uh, there is like a... Surely that... Cats can climb these types of fences, right? Oh yeah, it's been a while since we've had a, a good scratch. Right, how do I get in there? All the way around the back. Do you see anything there, Clementine? See, I can jump up here. Can't jump up there. Right, do you see anything? Uh, this door is the only way out of this jail. Okay, so you're just telling me the same thing. So over and over again. There must be a way into this, right? Can I jump up there? No. <laughs> Can't do anything with that. Can't do anything there. Uh, she's sort of looking over here. 
Can you not push this or something to somewhere where I can get up? See, this bin is virtually the only thing I can sort of climb on. There is also this bin. Up in the cone? Not up in the cone. Okay, now she's heading over here. Can you get me up into that tree? Uh, this could be a while for me to figure out what I need to do here. I'm adamant that I need to jump up in this box. That's not obviously the case. There's like no broken glass or anything in there. See, it looks like I, I sort of have to get up there, possibly. Uh, triangle. Oh, there's keys. Okay. We're in luck. They left the keys in the door. Hop in the back of the truck. You should be able to jump over the fence to access the secure area. Nice. Okay, okay. I'm on it. I'm on it. There we go. There we go. Uh, no sentinels here, so we're good to go. Vending machines clearly need a refill. Nothing over... Wait, what's that? It's just a box I can jump on. Alright, in we go. Oh, that's bad. Okay, 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 go, 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 oh! Oh god. Whoa, Clem. Don't leave without me. Oh my god, please stop. This is torture. There you go. Thank god this little three wheeler is faster than a sentinel. Oh, nice. <laughs> She jumped out of there, right? Whoa, what are you doing? There's no way we all, all make it. The sentinels are on our tail. Ah, Clementine. I can distract them for a little while, but you have to go. The Outsiders Manifesto says we must go outside at any costs. I wrote that. I wrote that. Oh man, that sucks. You're one of us now. It's not that everyone has to get to the outside, but one of us has to. You gained a new item, some wiki. Go now, I'll keep you in my ram, little outsider. Ram, that's pretty clever. Uh oh. Oh man. Well, that sucks. Ah. So we're going solo. Even Clem didn't make it. So we basically ditched Momo in the sewers. Baltazar was basically a lost cause. Doc had sort of gone crazy and went away to test off his machine and then wasn't interested in leaving because he had been reunited with his son. Uh, can I use an item? Okay, jump down. I think what we have to do is get the the battery in first. That's down here. And now we've abandoned Clem. Clem Town's been abandoned. I'm surprised we still got this battery. Uh, considering the fact that we were arrested, would it not have been taken off of us? Would they not have realized that it was the Neko Corp 
battery and then put it back in place to get the factory back up and running again. More questions than answers. But we're getting, uh, looks like we're getting to drive the subway train. It's pretty neat. Oh, yeah, that is not the front. There we go, use subway. Select the key. <laughs> oh, nice. I wonder if there are any Zerks in these subway tunnels. Also, if this subway train had been abandoned for hundreds of years, uh, would it still work? As nicely as, as it is working now. There you go, jump up. Jump up, get. I want to see where I'm going. Oh, you can't jump up in the seats for some reason. Oh well. We have arrived. Enjoy what? Oh, nice vending machine. Well, hello. Enjoy the world's safest city, Walled City 99. Hello, my friend. Helper 477, hello, how may I help you? Oh man. These surface robots don't have any personality. Or anything. It looks like they've still just been working here this entire time. Now I think I've got... Please stop jumping between the benches. I think I've got all the memories. Uh, I've obviously missed a lot, but I don't think there are any in this sort of area. But yeah, this, this area is pretty clean. Can we just go up those steps to the surface? There you go, cold drinks apparently. Up the travel are we go. Oh yeah, this area is nice. Hello my friend. Helper 062, greetings inhabitant of Walled City 99. Oh man, you don't get much conversation from these dudes at all. This guy's just painting. Helper 211, I am currently painting this area. Please be careful of the wet paint. Have a nice day. Oh, so they haven't got their own memories or sort of lifestyles. Aha! You can let me out. Greetings, inhabitant of Walt Saint 89. This door leading to the surface is currently locked due to the confinement procedure. Please refer to any certified engineer inside the control room if you have any requests. Have a nice day. Wait, so there are, there are engineers that are still alive? There's the control room. Oh, buddy. Helper 019, hello. How may I help you? Let me into the control room. <laughs> yeah, this area is a lot cleaner and nicer than some of the other areas. There's a guy cleaning a window there. Got some old newspapers. I can't read the newspapers, but they are there. And these guys have just been keeping this area clean. Whoa. So there's Midtown. That's where we just came from. It looks like there are other windows all the way around the city. Which is kind of nice. There's the big tower. And there's the sort of area where like Momo stays, etc. And all this is just almost in darkness. It's a shame. Helper 616, hello, my current task is clean the window. Please refer to any, any certified engineer inside the control room if you have any requests. Have a nice day. Okay, so these guys are not the most informative. Ah, man cutting plant. Helper 705, hello, the city has been sealed for your safety. 
Please be fair to any certified engineer in the control room. Okay, so we need to get to the control room. That is blatantly obvious. Oh, there's a weird vacuum bot thing there. Uh, inspect. Uh, the control room is closed by some sort of security protocol. It says that only humans are authorized to enter. It also says that I'm not considered human. Hey, that's offensive, security protocol. Maybe if we work together, we can open this passageway. I don't know this door. Where does this go? Ah, okay, so I can interact with that. Right, I think I need you. Uh, turn on. Follow me. And then I sort of need you to come over here. Oh, nice! It just sort of sits there. Uh oh. Uh oh. I can't actually interact with this. I'm pushing triangle, but nothing's happening. Ah, uh, okay. I needed B12 to do that first. And then... That's pretty dangerous. I'm pretty sure the cat would be absolutely fried there. Uh, depending on how many voltage uh, volts we're going through that... That there circuit stages blue. Wait. Is this timed? Okay, now we're in it. So it's, the cat's been fried like twice now. My bad. Oh, nice. We're into the control room. This is the control room for the entire city. They controlled everything from here and it's empty. Yeah, because everybody is dead. I remember hating them so much. They had everything. Clean space, limitless power, freedom to move. A little good it did them. Yeah, because everybody died. <laughs> the plague, I remember now. Everyone was dying and they thought they were, or they were above it all. They did nothing to help us. I watched my family die. I felt helpless and I couldn't do anything to save them. That shame. Poor B12. He's been through the mill. Uh, but I could still help you. We can still go outside together. I will carry the memories of humanity and the people I loved. Good. Good man, B12. Hey, it's the last memory. Uh, can I get a cup of coffee? Nope, I just did absolutely annihilate that coffee cup, though. Anything down here? Yeah, this area is looking a little less clean, although the, ro the sort of bots haven't been in here. Sort of cleaning this. Look at the city. It looks awesome. Can I turn on music for my stay? It's weird that they would have all this technology, but still use radio cassette players. Uh, seems kind of odd. <laughs> but there are no bodies or anything here, so... Let's have a look at this. Inspect. This is it. The main computer. Nice. According to the mainframe, no one has been here for years. The whole city is stuck in a lockdown cycle from long ago. If we disable it, we should be able to leave. We will need to bring the rest of these systems online. Uh, these computers hold the data we need. We need to turn them on. Okay. Uh, while you do that, I'll look for passwords and decrypted keys to get into the system. Wait. How am I going to turn on computers? I'm just a cat. Right, so these computers here... 
Okay, I get what I have to do. So if I just stand on a keyboard, stand on a keyboard, stand on a keyboard, uh, jump across to this one, stand on that keyboard, jump down, up onto this one, and this one, that one, and then these three. Over here, one, two, three. Alright, we're good to go. It worked. Good job, my friend. I found it. I know how to open the city. Something's off here. Ah. Oh, really? <laughs> it's been closed for years upon years, and, and it's. They just thought it was instantly gonna work. Wait, maybe there's a way around it. Uh, roof control station. Okay, so it's got three locks. Uh, there. That's the workstation to open the city. But there are several layers of security preventing us from using it. Uh, now we need to do what we do best. Me, I'll hack the machines and you destroy some stuff. This I can do. Right, so there's a lock there. Wait. There we go. Well done, cat. Okay, so that one is broken. You go and hack it. Oh! The, 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 the system is taking more than I expected. Yeah, be careful. Intrusion alert! Oh god. Okay. Oh no, we've got to keep going. Right, I see another lock over here. Excellent. There we go. Yeah, I'm surprised we're not getting electrocuted sort of more often. Do your stuff, B12. Whoa. Oh no. Oh no. That's bad. Don't worry, I can recharge once we open that other workstation. You better. Right, I see the third one over here. Right, we sort of have to run. I'm not sure if this is timed or not. Uh oh, hold on. Whoa! <laughs> I love the little animations for stuff like this. Alright, come on, bro. Last one, and be careful. Don't get zapped again. Whoa! I think... I think this little body is done for. Oh, no. It's okay, I'll be alright. Just carry me to the workstation. We can disable that alarm. You better be okay, B12. That's all I'm saying. I will be super upset if he dies. Oh, not there. There. There you go, buddy. Just recharge yourself there. It'll be fine. Uh, that's it. We're safe. Excellent. Listen, I have something to tell you. I knew the power required to disable the city's central control system would be immense, more than this drone body could handle. But with the security now disabled, I can take control of the system and open the city. Overriding it could destroy my software. But I made that choice when I hooked into the first computer and the consequences it could bring. Oh no. Oh man. Really? So we've abandoned everyone, now B12's gonna die. I, I wanted them to come outside and enjoy, like, the outside with me, and... Aw, oh, that sucks. I'm sorry we won't see the outside together. Yeah, me too, bro. I thought I needed to carry on the memories of humanity to hold on to the past. But I see a future 
and the companions and you. Can we not just download you into one of those bots outside? Here, let me take that off of you. Oh man, I lost my badges and my vest. <laughs> you are my friend, the very best I could have asked for. Thank you. Ah oh, man. Ah, what? This sucks. I'm not impressed with the ending of this. <laughs> See, now Tiddles is upset because his friend died. Is the roof going to open? It is. The roof is actually opening. Yeah, I would imagine there is a lot of debris, etc., on top of that roof. Oh, well, the Zerks are going to die because they don't like UV light. So that's really cool. Yeah, look at them. Nice. It's Momo. Momo lived. He escaped the sewers. That's cool. There's Doc and Seamus. Clementine. Oh, wait. The Sentinels just die when the... Uh, when the roof opens, it's kind of weird. Yeah, see, now you guys are going to have to deal with the rain and stuff. Okay, get up, Tiddles. Ah, oh, man. Okay, so we can lie next to sort of B12. We can't interact with them. I was kind of hoping we could uh, sort of pick him up, take him with us. Maybe someone will be able to repair him. Her? Ah. Well, that's like mega sad. I'm getting this weird artifacting. This is kind of cool though. Yeah, there's a lot of debris falling from the uh, the sky there. <laughs> Look out below. So the Zerks are dying because they don't like UV light. But if they get into the, the buildings, and the ones in the sewers will also still all be alive. Because they're not being exposed to sunlight. So even though we've opened the place up, it's technically still not a very safe sort of area. There we go. Everywhere is getting exposed to the light. Man, it takes a long time for this uh, roof to open. I'm surprised it actually still functioned after all these years. There's the lift. So there is a lift there. What about the people in the ant village? Because they're like sort of stuck underneath Midtown, sort of in this dam area. Well, let's say. Uh... Right, goodbye, B12. You are an awesome friend. Yeah, I'm getting this weird sort of blurring effect that I never used to get. Oh, the door just opens for me now, that's nice. And this one? Nice. Uh, the bots in here are still working. I wonder if they see anything different now that we've opened the dome. Oh, you can't talk to them. Okay. It's understandable. Right, you. Let me out. Man, there's a lot of vibration here. The city is open. 
Goodbye Midtown Slums, goodbye Underground City 99. I'm still super upset that everybody died. Well, not everybody, but B12 died. Any memories here? Are my cat friends gonna be here? Ah, it would be cool. So yeah, this is all overgrown. Hey, there's birds. Get the birds. Get the birds, tiddles. Yeah, where's my cat family? What? Wait. Cat family better be there. There he is. Our brave hero, Tiddles the Cat. Oh wait, what was that? What was that? <laughs> it's the end! Oh man. Well, that was actually a great little game. I had a lot of fun. I am not the greatest fan of cats, but I fairly enjoyed playing as a cat. Uh, I'm super upset that we never managed to get the, the companions, Clementine, Momo, etc. up to the surface. Uh, I'm also annoyed that B12 died, and the whole point of getting through this was so that we could get to the outside to meet our sort of cat family that we were with at the start. And we never found them. But it looks like when that little panel lit up at the side there, that there's possibly going to be some sort of sequel in the works. So that became cool. Uh, a neat little game. Not the longest game I've ever played, but I, I feel it is the sort of right amount of time to get from start to finish. Obviously you could spend a bit more time trying to get all the memories and stuff, etc. Uh, but yeah, it was a lot of fun. I really enjoyed playing this. Uh, there was something else I was going to say there, but I totally forgot. Yeah, it was... Yeah, it wasn't... Uh, it seemed more like a sort of showcase game. But it was a lot of fun. It was very nicely done. The lighting in some of the, the areas was sort of spot on throughout. Also, it performed, uh, performed flawlessly as well. There wasn't many sort of frame drips, uh, frame drops or anything. So, yeah, well done to B12 Studios. Straight, definitely a game to, if you're looking for something sort of short and fun to play through, this definitely be a game for you. So yeah, we'll leave it there for that episode. As always, if you did watch this and you would like to leave a like, comment, or dislike, please feel free to do so. And if there is more you'd like to see in the future, then hit the subscribe button. But I've been Danny Men. This has been a Let's Play of Straight, and I will catch you later.